think we got enough time to sort out all the fights, yeah. sort out all the lies. Oh, baby, yeah. Oh, no. There was a part of me that knew that. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, thank you so much for being here today. I am so excited to be bringing you some fall cleaning motivation today. So you're gonna get to see all of my fall decor throughout the video. If you missed my last video where I decorated for fall, I'll link that down in the description box if you guys are into home decor. But this video is all about the cleaning motivation. So I hope you enjoy it. Give it a thumbs up if you do. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and let's get right into it. So now that I'm back to school, I find that the weekends are pretty much the only time that I have to really deep clean. So we are tackling so many things in today's video. We're gonna get the kitchen, bathroom, the floors, and all that good stuff. So if you are in need of some serious cleaning motivation today, then grab that list and clean along with me. Let me know what you guys are up to down in the comments. Are you cleaning with me today or are you just sitting back and relaxing? I tried to pick some good relaxing music for this video if you were just sipping a cup of coffee and watching along. You were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. I guess our dreams fell asleep. There's no passion in the comatose. Baby, going down, 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 down. Baby, going down, 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 down. Tried so hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. And I thought. have been around for a while you may have noticed in a couple of my last videos that my kitchen faucet is different and I actually really love all of the functions on this kitchen faucet I had to get a new one because the one that I had bought before completely broke and I had bought it from Wayfair and I guess like the warranty was no longer good so we had to just go buy a new one I am probably not going to buy any like off-brand appliances or fixtures or things like that again just because it is not cheap to replace stuff like this but I am really happy with this one it is a Delta we got it at Lowe's and it's got some really awesome functions on it like the sprayer modes are really great it's got this one mode where it blasts like a really tiny but powerful stream of water if you're trying to get on any like baked on stuff off of your pans we also use it in the cat bowl because if the cat food dries up and we don't get a chance to wash it till later um, it can be really hard to get off and scrub off so that function on the faucet does a really good job I'll try to link this faucet down below if you are in need of one and if you have the same finishes as I do I do think that they had this in like a stainless steel but of course I had to go with the oil rubbed bronze to match everything else no more we don't know, no us, no more we don't know, no us, no more, no no. We don't know, no us, no more we don't know, no us, no more we don't know, no us, no more. Keep it nice and clean Not freak out and cause a scene I try to hold it together Keep it together Not show who I really am Just be cute and super bland I try to hold it together Keep it together Been playing it down But I'm so getting tired Now won't you meet
part of the weekend chore routine is definitely doing laundry. I'm doing a load of towels here, but I think on this day I had to do like five or six loads of laundry, which is pretty ridiculous, but <laughs> that is real life. So if you are in need of some motivation to get that laundry folded or just to throw a load in the washing machine, just try to do one load every day and it will make your life so, so much easier. For those of you that are just here for the Josie appearances, she definitely makes her appearance more than once in today's video. Sometimes it's funny the amount of times I have to clean around her, especially when I mop. I did not mop in this video today, but sometimes when I'm mopping, she will sit in the same spot for like five minutes, so I have to mop around her. And then when she leaves, there's like a very clear spot on the floor where I wasn't able to mop because she was sitting there. So those of you who are able to get chores done and clean while you've got multiple pets or kids underfoot, props to you. I'm gonna get this party lit. Come, come, come with me. Let's do something with regret. Cause I've been feeling, feeling that crazy and I need to lose control. So baby, put the record. So I don't really film very often in the music studio just because most of the time it stays pretty clean and I don't have a whole lot to do in there, but lately I have had several of my piano students finally taking lessons in my home studio, which is really exciting um, because last year, because of COVID, I went to their house and did lessons. So now I am so happy to finally have students here at my home studio. So this carpet gets a lot of love. So I want to give it a good vacuum and then I'm going to wipe down the piano. It's really hard to see. I should have done like a close up shot for you guys, but there were tons of little fingers prints all over it. Once you've seen all the things, all the places, I hope it means that you'll come home to me. Once you travel the world, all the spaces inside your heart. you guys really fast my grocery haul before I put all this stuff away and kind of like clean out the fridge um, this is just kind of like a midweek grocery shop so it's gonna be this plus other stuff I already have to kind of make dinners for this week so I'll try to tell you like kind of what I have in mind but this is all the meat that I got I got shrimp and I got some ground pork to try and do some um, like wonton like a recipe with wonton wrappers um, and then I'm going to use the other half of the ground pork for a different recipe or maybe like 
maybe I'll do like a quarter and then three quarters because this is a little over a pound of ground pork and we don't really eat pork very much. Um, mostly we eat chicken. So I got some chicken thighs and chicken breasts. These are both for recipes this week. And then I always keep at least one frozen pizza, maybe two in the freezer just in case we need like a quick dinner. So I picked up the Supreme one. I've got frozen green beans and frozen broccoli. The broccoli is going to be for a um, like teriyaki rice bowl. We really like that. It's super easy and quick. Um, mayonnaise or buy one, get one. Um, so I got two of those. This is for, I'm going to do breakfast for dinner this week. And I have a recipe that I found that looks really good. And I will probably share what I think about it over on my Instagram the night that we make it. So make sure you're following me over there. It's kind of like a biscuit and gravy type recipe. Um, ranch seasoning packet is for a recipe that I haven't tried before. So we'll have to see how I like that. I got a couple of onions. Um, I needed some more like stick butter. I use this for mostly baking. Um, I got two kinds of cheese. I got sharp cheddar and then mozzarella for a recipe this week. We're going to use refried beans tonight to do nachos while we watch football. This is for the like breakfast biscuits and gravy thing. I just needed six eggs. Um, and then, uh, this is the milk that we drink, skim milk, whole milk. I got a small one for a recipe. And then this is the butter, like the spread butter that we use. We don't use real butter. We use, um, vegetable oil butter, and this is like good for your heart. So I was out of that. So yeah, like I said, this is kind of like a midweek, like midway through the week kind of stock up on some things. So I am going to put all of this away and kind of clean out the fridge and freezer as I do that because it definitely needs to be tidied. I was at the wrong place at the right time. All right, we are on to day two and I just have a little bit more cleaning. This is just real life, you guys. Sometimes I get a lot done on the weekends and sometimes I gotta split it up across two days. But after we take care of the fridge, we're gonna go upstairs and do some vacuuming and just some other tidying up that I did not get to the day before. If you are liking this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. It really helps me out so much. about everything that was on our mind talking to you gave me butterflies then you took my hand said let's leave now don't wanna be shy
So I've been thinking about getting an air purifier for upstairs or really one air purifier that I could carry back and forth between upstairs and downstairs. If you guys have an air purifier in your house that you really love, then leave me a comment with the link to it um, down below because Jack and I have looked at several different kinds of air purifiers online and they have good reviews but the ones on Amazon are like off brands and I just never know how I can trust those so if there's one that you've had for a long time and it has, you've not had any problems with it and it's really lasted for you then let me know what it's called and I will definitely take a look at it because with the carpets up here and the cat and stuff I just kind of feel like an air purifier might be a little bit necessary the air is often really still up here too with only one air conditioner unit so anyway that's just a random thought I had but that is gonna be it for today's video thank you guys so so much for watching if you enjoyed it please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing I would love to have you and I will see you guys again really soon with a brand new video bye guys you can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high even if the sky is falling down